there is no give to it whatsoever and it just makes for a very challenging application if you get what I'm saying so you know hopefully we can see um, what happens at the end of the day with these lipsticks because I am not very pleased right now Hey guys, welcome back to my channel to another lipstick swatch video. If you are new here, my name is Shemaine and I do lipstick swatches. If you have been with me, I thank you for your continued support. But these are the BH Cosmetics Cashmere Cream Comfort Lipsticks. There are actually seven of them and yeah, this is what the packaging looks like. So this should be a fun lipstick swatch. I haven't done like this many swatches in a very long time so I'm definitely looking forward to it. So without any further ado, let's just jump right in. just taking a break here but we've been through five colors already I'm down to two more colors left to do but so far I don't know I'm not as excited about these lipsticks I think it's because they've been applying so streaky and I don't really like the applicator so much it's just so stiff I need some flexibility in the applicator and this applicator is just dead stiff there is no give to it whatsoever and it just makes for a very challenging application if you get what I'm saying so you know hopefully we can see um, what happens at the end of the day with these lipsticks because I am not very pleased right now. So we're down to the last shade. This one is called Extra and it's a more mauve shade. I left this one for last because I think this was my favorite shade so I hope it actually delivers. But so far like I said I've not been impressed with the application or the applicator. I just didn't find it to be user friendly. It was as stiff as a corpse and you just can't get around the contours of your lips without you know going over your lip line. Anyways we don't want to go down that road. Let's go ahead and swatch the last shade here.
Okay, so this is the last shade that we have here. It is called Extra. And I really do like this color. So that's why I had saved it for last because this was the one that caught my eyes. I'm like, hmm, I think this is the one that I would want to wear and test out. Uh, the formula, however, it's like, it's described as a cashmere cream. It does feel very soft, cloudy, fluffy. It's like a light formula. Um, more like a moussey, fluffy texture. And that feels really light on the lips. So I'm glad that it doesn't put any weight or it feels like I'm not actually wearing anything. That's always a good feeling for me. And it doesn't dry right away. I should have looked up if it is a matte finish or not. But my, my lips are still wet, like you can tell. So because it's a creamy formula, I'm guessing it might not dry completely matte. So it'll be interesting for me to find out what happens with this. Um, an itch but this is the shade that I'll be wearing for the rest of the day um, as you guys know I test these out to see how long they last and yada 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 so we're gonna see how this fares off we're gonna test it against the elements you know drinking eating and just pretty much wearing it and then I'll come back with a final review of my thoughts on the BH Cosmetics cashmere cream lipstick i almost forgot to do a time check here so right now it's 12 12 okay 12 12 so um when i come back we're gonna do another time check to see what this lipstick look like um but yeah, I will see you guys in the next several hours, I guess. Bye. Hey guys, uh, it's a little chilly out today, but um, I had to leave the house to do some errands. I just came out the store. I spent like two hours in there, had my mask on. And um, yeah, so this is like the three hour check-in and this is what my lipstick looks like right now. I think it's still pretty decent. It did, mm, no, I thought it would have rubbed off a little bit and smeared all over my face, but to be honest, it's pretty much still intact, even though quite a bit of it um, came off on the mask. But I gotta say, I am impressed so far. Uh, the comfort of it, it's still very comfortable. My lips don't feel dry or cracked or anything like that. So, but yeah, guys, it looks really good and I am impressed. So I'll do another check-in with you guys in like probably the next three to four hours just to give you my final update on these. And I gotta say, I am looking forward to it. So yeah, I'll check in with you guys at the end of tonight. Bye. Hey guys, I am back with my final thoughts on the BH Cosmetics Cashmere Cream Lipsticks. And I did a three hour check in with you guys to show you what the lipstick was looking like. And like you saw, it was still intact even after wearing a mask for three hours because I was running errands for three hours as soon as I had finished filming. I went to take care of some errands and then in my car I showed you what it looked like after removing my mask. So now it is, let's do our time check. Um, it is 6.27 p.m. I just had my dinner, literally dinner was at 6 o'clock and I had dinner and this is what is left of the lipstick so my dinner pretty much took everything away okay so all you can see is a little bit um, on the lining or perimeter of my lips but um, other than that everything has disappeared so my dinner took all of that away to be honest um, I don't I think if I did not eat anything that lipstick would still be on because as you can see from my three-hour check-in 
even with the mask on, it was still intact. And even when I got home, everything was still okay after, you know, around five o'clock, everything was still good. But as soon as I was done with dinner, and I didn't hold anything back. I wasn't trying to eat sloppy or anything. I, would, I just ate like how I usually eat. And mm, the food was good too. But overall, it's a decent lipstick, decent price, decent wear time. And I think it'll be worth trying these out. Not all of the colors worked for me. The lighter shades were not the most flattering, but as I moved into the darker plums and pinks, I started to enjoy them a little bit more. So let me know if you guys have tried these lipsticks or you're deciding if you want to try them. If you do, leave me a comment in the comment section and let me know how you like them or didn't care for them, whichever. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching my channel. It does help me out at the end of the day. It helps me to continue to put more content out for you guys to see and make a more informed decision. Again, thank you so much for all the support and I will catch you in my next lipstick swatch video. Bye!